Well, John. What Wednesday? That's wrong. It's Wednesday, and my voice still isn't back yet. <laughs> my favorite thing about LeakyCon was the first four days of it. Really, though, I just loved seeing all of you guys because it was so amazing to meet you all, and you were all so beautiful and so brilliant, and that was awesome. I loved meeting everyone. I loved sharing something that I loved with so many awesome people and so many people who turned out to be famous and I coincidentally made friends with them, sort of. My favorite thing probably overall was the random adventures we went on, like kidnapping John Cozart and having him ask me that question, or going and finding a wig and a bow tie randomly and then getting admitted to the rehearsal for the opening ceremony, or crying with Lauren Fairweather over meeting Anthony Rapp because that was like the coolest and thing ever. Also what was awesome for me was the um, Wizard Rock concerts because I love Wizard Rock and that was my first time ever seeing it live. But yeah, more so than celebrating Harry Potter with a bunch of awesome people, which was um, a highlight of my life, I loved all the random encounters that happened. For me, the stuff outside of the programming is definitely what made LeakyCon worthwhile and I'm really glad that it all happened. What was I going to say? Oh, yeah, I'm really glad that there were other fandoms there besides Harry Potter because while Harry Potter is like my life, so is sci-fi, as you can see from, you know, my Firefly poster in the background right there. 10th anniversary, thanks very much. It was really cool to be able to meet people who loved something I loved, but then also loved other things that I loved. So it was just like this love fest and it was really great and really exciting. Seeing as how it was my first LeakyCon, I was just really excited about everything and everyone and like anytime any little thing happened, I was like, oh my god, so that was fun. Mostly I just miss you guys now. I was like hanging on my apartment today and it's my second day without any of you here since I had Laura until Tuesday morning. So it's just like, oh that's over now and it's really sad and I really miss you guys a lot so we have to like stay in super contact and seeing all those photos was really great on Facebook so thank you for posting those. I honestly think that it it would not have been the weekend it was without all of you there and I'm so glad that you all got to come to like my hometown and celebrate how great stuff is. Oh this is our kitty Ellie she's really sweet. What are you doing? She just snuck into my room while I was doing this. You're a little full video bomber, aren't you? Mwah. Yes, she's very cute. Okay, bye. <laughs> so I guess it's question time now for Patricia. That's new. Wednesdays are so weird, guys. Patricia, how are you doing? How are you feeling, for one? And for another, since we're all talking about Harry Potter, and I'm, I'm really sorry about that, I want to ask, um, since Wizard Rock was a highlight for me, and for n honestly not very many other people in our group, except for Laura, she was game. Are you a fan? And if so, what is your favorite band? And if you're not into that, then just talk about, I want to know your favorite scene in Harry Potter. That's a daunting question, but I want to know. Okay, I will see you all next Wednesday, since I made a promise to you and I will be seeing you every week this summer.